I think the switch is on the side on this one. That's it. Hold on, uh, this is quite technical <laughs> for me. <laughs> Richard, you came down on Friday to meet Pat and see the museum. Please share your thoughts. Glad to. Morning. Very nice to see you. How fantastic to see this on a high street as well. Um, yeah, I came along here because you sent me details of it in an email. And like all of us, you get a lot of emails. But the story in this one caught my eye. The timing of it, for one thing. This is a museum. So yes, it's looking back into the past. But it also is very useful as we look into the future now. The car, the subject of this museum, is undergoing significant change. And we all acknowledge has to and will do, but at the same time, it will still provide the service it always has for us, which is move us around our lives, enable us to do everything we want to do. The theme of this museum I found particularly um, relevant right now, because it's about the cars that many of us, and I can see a few grey heads there, sir, just, just saying, um, will remember these aren't necessarily the cars that we had on our poster wall. Some of them are, some of them are the cars that took us to school, that we learned to drive in, that moved us around. And it's a reminder as we move forwards into the future, whatever shape that has to take, that when the car was invented, what was it? It was a novelty. Oh look, Carruthers is coming up the drive and there's no horse in front of his carriage. How does he do that? It was a novelty for, for rich people. And then it became something for everybody that enabled us to live our lives. It shapes our lives and our world. And as we reinvent it now, it's important that we do so whilst remembering what we owe it and what it's done for us. And this museum has a role to play in doing just that. I also think particularly important, and I know this will be spoken about today, but I want to add my feelings that how fantastic that it's on a high street. It's in the centre of your town. So you can, on a Saturday, whenever you're wandering past, dive in and have a look and connect with these incredible essential machines that have shaped our world. Um, and finally, from me, obviously, it has been a monumental team effort putting this whole thing together. Um, I've heard tales of people working till four or five o'clock in the morning this week to get everything ready. Um, but we should all acknowledge and salute one particular individual's driving passion, pun intended, um, to get this thing on the road. Second pun, also um, Pat, it's, I absolutely salute you. It's an incredible achievement. It really has consumed this entire world. Um, but it is now going to be opening today so that we can all enjoy the res results of it. So I would ask that, probably not for the first time today, a massive round of applause for Pat. Well done, sir. Great, great to see you all here today. Thank you so much.